the last two videos were about five beginner mistakes and three tips for the professional investor. Something that I'm getting asked a lot is, how should I sell my stock? Well, the answer to that is really simple. Selling is the inverse of buying. But before I go into the how you should sell your stock, let's talk about the why. There are really good reasons to sell a stock. First, you sell a stock when you need the money for something else. This could be private consumption, you want to buy a car or a house or go on holidays. This is for your personal life. But it could also be because you want to go out of that industry, out of that market, into another one. That means you need the money for something else. Now, there are also really bad reasons to sell. We already covered in the five beginner mistakes, it's a bad reason to sell when everything looks bad. But it's even a worse reason to sell when the stock price dropped. Because when the stock price dropped, you're getting less for your stock and it's still the same stock. Now, let's assume you have a good reason to sell. How do you go about it? Well, you inverse your process of buying. Let me explain you how I buy stock. I start with the Obermott ranks. When a company has a good Obermott rank, it means I want to look at it. The second thing is, I look at all the companies with good Obermott ranks and I decide in what region and in what industry I want to invest. If I then have identified a few companies that match the region and industry I want to buy, I look at the company in more detail and I decide if I like to invest in that company. The inverse of that process is quite simple. First, you look at the Obermott ranks again and you sell those with really bad Obermott ranks in your portfolio. Now, you will have a few companies with bad Obermott ranks because these ranks fluctuate over time and if you invest it for a longer period of time you will have companies with bad Obermott ranks in your portfolio. Now you look at the industries and the region and you decide what region, what industry is the one you want to get rid of because maybe you want to be better diversified. Finally, you look at those companies in those region and industries and you make a decision which company to sell. This is how I go about selling stock, but for so far I'm investing because I'm saving for my retirement. I wish you good luck with your self-investing.